Triple Trio starts here with a Class 3 contest for race set number 4. 16.50 is set the trip. And we have a field of 11 heading to post, headed by Delightful Lau. Tony Cruz, Karis Tietney, one fresh up here back in uh, April. He's first up for the season. Uh, real busy third to Alpha Hedge on his return back on the uh, the ninth. Nam Jong Plus also coming out of the Alpha Hedge race. He finished in fifth. Flash Famous returns. He's a four-time course and distance winner. Wealthy Delight from the 12 up to the 16.50 on his second start for John Size. Working away further down. Rich and Lucky first up for the season as well. Also a course and distance winner last season. An urban dancer got upset in the gates um, back on the, the 9th of this uh, month. So he's been back at the trials. Really busy and flash famous, Tom, are the horses that have been up at Chungfa. Yeah, Richard Lucky will go forward to here. He led last time out over Alpha Hedge, uh, or behind Alpha Hedge at last time out. He did try with the hood on, but he's not wearing the hood race day. And Shrine to, will be handy for Zach Purton, Flash Famous. Real busy, should get a nice uh, cart through out of gate number two. Tasha Delic, Urban Dancer, it's looking awkward for Keith Young out of uh, gate number 10, as Andrew mentioned before. Has been back to the trials, did trial quietly, but trialled uh, very well before that did to Urban Dancer. He's delightful, Lauer. Now, he did win on debut here in Hong Kong. Uh, blinkers will go on him for the first time, and he worked really well with those blinkers on. You can see just running away from his partner horse. So uh, he looks like he's uh, ready to go a good race here uh, at Happy Valley. Real busy. He's had that run. He'll come on for that run, and it was a nice piece of work from him as well. He's one second up before as well. Real busy. So uh, good piece here from uh, him. Vincent Ho will take them out from Barrier 2. And Rich and Lucky just working with his... Uh, Stable partner there. He goes nicely as well, Rich and Lucky. He's the one closest to us. I thought his work wasn't too bad as well. He's likely to go forward. Another one that does go well fresh. All right. Well, let's have a look at uh, some of these in action. Starting off with a form race, or a race where the form, I think, is going to work out uh, quite well. Alpha Hedge is the winner. We're looking at Real Busy and Nam Jong Plus down the outside. But the horse right in the middle there, Tom, in the yellow and black cap, actually ran them ragged last week. He yeah, did uh, Lightning Steed coming out and winning. I thought at this point here, Real Busy looked uh, done. But to his credit, he actually uh, stayed on quite OK for a third placing. And keep an eye on uh, Nam Jong Plus. He settled well back, and he was really doing his best work late down the outside. So we're... Uh, Ticks for both of those horses, Paul. Yeah, I've got them both in. I think this is um, a good form race to look at as well, especially with Lightning Steed coming out of it. And uh, Real Busy has won second up in the past. All right, so possibly uh, dangerous there. Flash Famous uh, first up uh, for the season. We're looking at uh, Nam Jong Plus engaged and Rich and Lucky here as well, Paul. Yeah, now Rich and Lucky, he'll, uh, he's likely to lead in this race uh, when he gets to the races. Flash Famous, he was the best of these three. We're going back to June last year, and he had the line nice enough in this race. It was a nice enough run from the Flash Famous. He had a really good season last season. Uh, at the beginning of the season, he was one win from 23. He ended up being five from 32, so he had a great uh, season. Joe Marrero reunites with him, and he seems to get on well. Out of the trial, he was in up at Chungfa. Sky Supreme came out and hacked up at the weekend. He did indeed. All right, enshrined uh, an interesting one here, uh, Tom, because he's had six starts here in Hong Kong so far. They've all been on the all-weather. What do we make of him switching to the turf? He has trialled at Happy Valley in the past, uh, has enshrined. I thought he had a pretty similar run on the trail as to what he did behind Utopia Life uh, at the back end of uh, last season. And he just battled on uh, for mine. I did find a, a spot for him because um, he has had the benefit of looking around Happy Valley and Zach Purton gets on board. But gate 11 is the little worry, Paul. Yeah, that's what put me off. Gate number 11, first time at Happy Valley under race conditions. Mm, interesting one, all the same. Barry 11, Zach Purton and Casper found uh, certainly worth uh, some sort of consideration. Uh, Flash Famous has come as our favourite, Paul, in a very open market, though. Yeah, this is a really tricky race, I thought. But I'm going to go real busy. He's got that really good second up record. Uh, look, he's one off 70 and 71. He's up to 76, but the horse is going well, and he should get his opportunity from barrier number two. Nam Jong Plus comes out of that same race, and he's one off a high rating before. He's got barrier one. Another one drawn low, delightful Lau. I, I like the fact the blinkers go on him for the first time. I think that's a, a good thing for him, and he uh, sort of lost his way a little bit after winning impressively on debut here in Hong Kong. And then Wealthy Delight. He ran nicely enough, I thought, over 1,200, up to 16.50 second time. Two, three, one, and six. Looking for some value in this race and uh, found Wealthy Delight on top out of the John Size stable. Uh, Chad Schofield riding from gate number six. Now, he wasn't in touch with them at all, basically, in that uh, run. He was tailed off, but uh, he was hitting the line quite strongly, I thought, over the final stage. And the step up to was 16.50 should suit. He did place over 1,600 metres in Australia. So second up, Wealthy Delight, two real busy, seven enshrined, and three Nam Jong Plus, six, two, seven and three. Yeah, I'm quite keen on Wealthy Delight as well. I think it's a good price as well, nearly 20 to 1. About the price, the place price of uh, winning Endeavour there, 
David Ferraris, Alex Lai, 1.1 at the moment. That's race number four, first leg of the TT.